So it seems like one of the biggest things that people are not happy about with Android 12 or 12L, whatever you prefer to call it, on Surface Duo and Duo 2 is a change to the quick settings. If I pull this down here, you will see that there is no separate set of quick toggles for Wi-Fi and mobile data. You actually have to click on this, you get a little fly out, and then you can toggle mobile data slash Wi-Fi there. But there's no like quick way to just toggle it. In this video, I'm going to try to very quickly show you a way to alleviate that problem. Step one, we're going to click on the link in the description. We're going to download the, the uh, platform tools for your platform of choice. Okay, this is going to allow us to use the Android Debug Bridge ADB to do some stuff on our Surface Duo. So download that. You're going to get a zip file. Extract that zip file folder. In that folder is another folder. Change the name of that folder to ADB, put it in the root of your C drive because it's just simplest to do that. So you have the C drive, folder called ADB, and then the files, they're in that, in there. I've shown this a couple of times. Hopefully that is uh, detailed enough. If not, maybe I'll link to another video where I talked about doing this for another thing and then I'll help explain it. Anyways, that's where we should be now. So now what we're going to do is we're going to hit start and type in CMD and hit enter to launch the command prompt. We're then going to type in CD c colon slash adb and there's there's your reason right there for why we changed the name and put it in the c drive it just makes that process like 50 times easier back on our phone we're going to plug our device into our computer you do need to make sure that you have developer options enabled and that adb debugging is enabled so if you haven't done this go under our settings we're going to go to about we're going to scroll down to build number. Click on that a bunch of times until developer options are enabled. Go into system and then developer options and make sure that ADB debugging, sorry, USB debugging is enabled. Once you plug it in, you should get a pop up on your phone that will ask you if you want to enable or to allow, I should say. At this point, we're free to paste in the first command, which will be that. You may get your prompt to allow or so forth there. If that is the case, you may have to run that again. Okay, so we just ran it a second time. Should be okay. Now we're going to paste in the next command. And theoretically, we should be good, question mark? Hey, look at that. We got mobile data and we got Wi-Fi separated. Easy as can be. I'll also paste in the description the commands to reverse this and to put things back to normal. I actually am not particularly bothered by this. So I'll tell you what, I'll reverse mine live here and you can see it go back. So the first command, all we got to do is just change that to true. And then I think it's the same command the second time. Yeah, and I'd actually just saw it go back. So you can reverse this very, very easily. So no real concern there. Nothing really can go all that wrong. It's either going to work or it's not. And you can put it right back. Guys, hopefully that makes you feel a little bit more at home on your Surface Duo now running Android 12. Hopefully that solves that problem for you. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. I will see you on the next one. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.